Hi everyone, it's Kasha Plannerista101. Today we are planning in my homebody, which is my social media planner for the week of the 13th through the 19th of January. And I decided to use the homebody sticker book as this is the homebody planner. And I wanted to do a whole spread with the sticker book and we'll see how that goes. First and foremost, I'm going to do some checklists for my youtube as well as my instagram since this is my social media i track both of those things up here so i use a checklist and i put instagram and youtube in there and i just use my pilot g2 pen to do that and then i'm gonna yeah that's enough that's every day so that'll be my instagram and then the longer one will be my YouTube. And those, those squares are nothing for nothing in particular. However, I do like the look of them. So I keep them in there. And I just drew a line with a pencil to kind of have these... Instagram lines extend and then after a while when the pen dries I'll erase those I'm just writing the days of the week for myself and I'm gonna use those tiny box stickers and homebody to cover up So this will become my to-do, errands will become list of videos, and then important will become subscribers. So those are the videos I'm working on this week, whether it's for next week or this week. I just put whatever I'm working on this week. And then on the days of the week, I put whatever comes out, where the video's plans are, that's where I put every single day what video is coming out or there's days without videos because I do have a full-time job and my own business that I run on top of this so I don't film every single for every single day but I do post quite a bit of videos and on days of the week I write down tasks that I need to do and then in boxes I write down the videos that are coming out on a particular day. So this is my first month using this as my social media planner so it's very interesting to me to see how this will be turning out. So far, I do like it. I mean, I've only had, this is my third week that I'm going to be tracking all of this. I was tracking it in my Inkwell Plat Press, but that was a completely different layout. So we'll see how this works out down the line. But so far, I do enjoy it. So I put that big floral wreath on the bottom to match the spread and put, pull all the colors together. And I found boxes in modern, um, I mean in homebody, that I'm just going to be placing on the days that I'm posting videos. So I usually post one on Wednesday, Thursday, and Sunday. And sometimes the Thursday becomes Friday, so it just depends. And then those big green leaves, I'm just going to be distributing them all over the place. I think they're so beautiful. The only issue I have, these foil stickers are so hard to capture on camera because they're shimmery. So I do prefer paper stickers, but these leaves are absolutely gorgeous.
the florals in the spread are really beautiful as well. I can't get over how beautiful all, all of the Happy Planner florals are actually really, really pretty. And I enjoy every single one. So I'm just putting leaves all over and then I'm going to add florals to the spread. Those clusters of florals are really beautiful and I do like the, how that looks. And I'm going to put this right on the edge. I didn't like how these florals were laying horizontally, so I put them vertically and I do like this a lot more. I think it adds some interest to the page and it still gives me quite a bit of room to write, so that's kind of how I did that. And I think that works out pretty great. And then I'm going to take one of these boards and then place it in the wreath. I think they'll look really pretty and also there there's good in the world and whenever i think about my social media and planning babes and everybody who's planning there's so much good in the world you guys are so amazing this community is so supportive of each other and really accepting and i really really am proud to be a part of it i i really am whenever i think about how i found this community and how i became part of it it really makes me proud to be part of it, which I can't say about every single community out there, but this one is one of those that there's not very many bad apples and most of, most of the apples are just amazing. So you guys are giving me hope and joy in this world. All of those planner babes are just so accepting and amazing and beautiful human beings. So I'm really, really proud to be a part of it. So I'm just trying, I'm just kind of putting stickers all over the place and trying to see how that would look. And I decided to move that orange one a little down. So you will see what I do. And place the sticker, the pink one on top and then orange in between. I really do hope that you enjoyed this video. It's very simple. It's my social media spread. I try to decorate it, but there's so much writing going on because I am releasing quite a bit of videos every single month or every single week. I hope you really enjoyed this and let me know what you think down below. Do you use a dashboard layout? Do you have any issues with it? Do you have a hard time? What do you guys use your dashboards for please let me know down below i'm always really curious to see what everybody is doing and thanks so much for watching if you're subscribed to my channel thank you so much i am so blessed to grow pretty quickly as i'm growing and if you're not subscribed to my channel please, please consider doing so i really hope you guys have a great week and happy planning bye